Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Hope you all are doing well by Allah's almighty grace. Inshallah, Eid Mubarak to all Muslims out there and to everyone. Hope you all had great Eid and hope you all are having great Eid inshallah with your loved ones. Eid Mubarak to the ones who are celebrating today and Eid Mubarak to the ones who celebrated yesterday. So just a last episode from Ramadan series. Uh, it's been a great uh, Ramadan series with you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this whole series inshallah the knowledge i have shared with you guys i hope you will apply in your life and i hope i will also apply it in my life inshallah so this is just the final episode of ramadan series of 2023 inshallah next year we will come back with another new series inshallah so just a quick reminders from this series the the first one is the things which i've taught you guys or which I've told you guys during this series, try to apply it in your life, try to apply in the upcoming 11 months, inshallah. Because the things you have done in Ramadan, if you do it in the remaining days as well, you will gain Allah's forgiveness and mercy, inshallah. Because it's the Allah which you had in Ramadan, it's the same Allah after Ramadan as well. There is no difference in Him. There is no difference in His mercy, in His blessings. So why not we utilize this time as well? Why not we continue our practices? Try to pray five times a day. Try to. I'm not telling. Try to read whole Quran. <clears throat> I'm only telling you to read one page a day. Just read one page a day. Try to read one hadith a day. One hadith takes one minute to be, to read. So it's like better to read one page a day, which takes around five minutes, five or six. Maybe that's too much, but it takes. And on average five to six minutes try to read one hadith every day try to do charity as much as you can on Fridays maybe you can or maybe on the normal days but in whatever way you like so try to continue these practices in your life to gain Allah's mercy and his blessings because that's all we want in our life so try to carry on these things inshallah you will have you you will enjoy your life you will not have problems in your life you will enjoy it you will have peace you will have your you your family will have blessings so continue these practices inshallah and allah will forgive our sins and he will bless us with the blessings he will forgive us and these things be what in our life so just i wanted to let these things know to you guys and uh, I hope you guys liked this series, inshallah, and uh, thanks for all the responses. I've got the likes, the comments, and all the advices and suggestions because that motivates me to, to make more videos. Uh, so keep on doing that, inshallah. Uh, inshallah, I'll start a new series of uh, morning adhkar and evening adhkar, inshallah, and there will be more videos coming from my side inshallah so see you guys in the other videos inshallah jazakallah khair barakallahu feekum assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh yeah, so before ending i would just like to let you know about an app uh, which you can download in your mobile uh, the name of the app is hisni uh, which spells like h i s n double -I, I hisni I'm letting you guys know about this app because every day uh, after you download this app, you can receive a hadith of the day, which uh, which is a good thing. Like without even searching for something, uh, automatically you will receive an, a notification uh, about the hadith of the day and you can open and read it and you can have the reward inshallah. And there are many uh, Quranic uh, ayahs which contains supplications in that app. And there are supplications such as while going to bed, uh, while entering the mosque, uh, while sleeping, uh, while uh, in the uh, before uh, evening time, in morning time. So there are like many things in that app. So I thought of sharing this app with you guys. You can find the link of this app in the uh, description below. And uh, you can download this app, inshallah.
جزاك الله خيرا السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته